Well, local first responders will have a safe space to seek refuge when weather disasters strike. Panama City commissioners approved a state grant at Tuesday's commission meeting. That grant will help fund the first phase of a new emergency operations center behind the Panama City Police Department. The EOC will serve as a main response hub after a natural disaster. It will also have the ability to house more than 200 first responders at one time. We want to be there to support our citizens in their great time of need. Right after a disaster, after a storm, uh, we want to be able to respond and better coordinate through the operations center, uh, the deployment of first responders to meet the needs of our citizens. Commissioners also approved state grant funding for a safe room. The public's work facility is receiving it. The room will serve as a safe haven for public works employees during inclement weather. City officials say those employees will be able to clean up streets and repair lift stations more efficiently after storms. We recognize after Hurricane Michael, not only our first responders, but our, our public works employees are all essential to the recovery efforts of the city. City leaders say the EOC could cost up to $4.5 million. They also say the public works safe room is expected to cost around $180,000 for the whole project. There isn't a set completion date yet for either project.